Good news, my wonderful people. You will be surprised. Olusha Gobasanjo finally speaks. And what he's saying to Nigerians is quite golden. It's, he didn't say anything particular. All he said is, we will do the right thing when the time comes. I believe Nigerians knows what is best. My dear, if that will not be parable, I don't know what else that will mean. No. You know, if that is not parable, I don't know what else that means. All he said is that <laughs> we will do the right thing when the time comes. It's not your meeting me. Your meeting me is just a, it's just one of those things. It's not the thing. Okay, we'll do the right thing when the time comes. Okay, so my wonderful people, this is what is happening right now. So we'll do the right thing. What is that right thing? Whether you visit me or not, we vote the right person. Yes. Hey. Now, wow. <laughs> things are beginning to you are beginning to look up, and um, we are beginning to see how these things are, you know, playing out. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Olusha Gwabasanjo finally speaks. Says, we will do the right thing when the time comes. Obasan just said, after meeting with Tinubu, now he speaks to Nigerians, I believe you know what is right. According to Saha reporters, the former president of Nigeria, Lushegwa Basanjo, has berated the People Democratic Party for choosing Atiku Abubakar, the presidential candidate of the presidential candidate of PDP ahead of 2023. He met with Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, the presidential candidate of the all progressive congress although the former president endorsed although the former president seemed to have been with atiku when he contested for the presidency in 2019 why speaking at his hilltop home in abi okuta why meeting with ashiwajo made bola tinubu obasanjo made it clear that he does not support atiku because he believed that it is the turn of the south for nigeria to produce the next president after a northern and has been there for the past, by next year, eight years. But he made a comment concerning Tinubu, may, maybe Tinubu waiting for an endorsement words to come from, forth, saying, we will do the right thing when the time comes. I believe Nigerians knows what is best and what is right for them. Nigerians will decide and they will do the right thing when the time comes. There is no need to force it on. We know what is right. We know what to do. And this, I believe, Nigerians will do and make the right decision as the times draw near. This has sparked up a lot of reaction as the elder statesman has been seen to speak, speaking in parable with regards to this matter. He also noted that the decision of PDP is not politically correct because it was at a meeting where it was agreed upon that power will shift between the north and the southern parts of the country. Finally, the former president noted that north has already ruled for eight years. And PDP should have given the ticket to a southerner. He concluded by saying that they will do the right thing. Nigerians will do the right thing. They will vote in the right person when the time comes. Well, my people, again, like they will always say, hmm? they say we will know what to do. When the time comes, when you get to the junction, when you get to that road, you will cross it. Okay? When we get to the junction, we'll cross it. So Nigerians have, they have been told that they will do the right thing when the, right, when the time comes. And it is right, it is so. It is high time we begin to rise up to the occasion and ensure that um, we vote in the right candidates, whether you like it or not. Most of these persons, these politicians you are seeing, politicians at his way, as it were, they mostly look out for themselves, not for you, not for me, not for anyone. They are looking out for themselves. And if we want to make a difference, we want things to change. Every one of us have got a duty to rise up to the occasion, to vote in the right persons, the right man, the right woman. If we continue to deceive ourselves, <laughs> nothing will happen. I can assure you for free. And so the best time to begin to ensure that we are putting in, we are putting in our best and bringing out our, our, the, our best foot out is now. It is now. Okay. So Lucia Gwabasanjo was with... Um, Tinubu, like you all know, but again, the meeting, you know, he didn't say anything particularly much, so to say, he didn't say A or B, you know, he didn't really say anything, but again, he has said it that, I mean, he, he could not hide his feelings that, you know, we agreed, and he said PDP betrayed themselves, we agreed that power will shift between the north and the south, it was an agreement, but to see that PDP 
you know, has broken that very code, the, one of their very code of conduct. They know they broke it. How can they be expecting, you know, they said they should have given it to a Southern and why did they allow Northerners to participate in that very said, uh, uh, it, it is not right. Northerners should not have been part of it at all. Buhari would have ruled for how many years? I mean, with all that is happening, it's still a chance and a game for everybody or anybody. Yes, it's still that, that is still there. And so we have to be honestly, honestly sure of what we are doing. Okay? That time of merry go rounding and trying to see if we are... No, no, no. Those days, those days and those times, eh, they are far over. And it is time everybody begin to take the right decision in order for us to move forward. Okay, so if we want difference, if we want truth, we have to rise up to the occasion. We have to ensure, okay, that we're not staying on the side of lies. We're not staying on the side of those who do not mean well for us, but we are sincerely rising up to the occasion. Okay, again, you can see to a large extent that the man called uh, Wiki may be justified in his anger in all that is going on between himself, okay, currently and, uh, and uh, Atiku. Because Atiku himself should have managed this better. But what has Atiku done? Has he really gone on board to ensure that, you know, he, he, he tried to, uh, you know, rad eradicate any kind of bad blood between them? I don't think he has done enough in that regard. Anyway, politicians be politicians. Don't let them deceive you. At the end of the day, they know how they rule. You know how they rule. One person will become Nigerian's president, whether you like it or not. Mm, one person will become Nigerian's president and then we all know exactly, uh, you know, who that person will be. So the time to arise, okay, the time to ensure that um, we are ready. Yes, we are ready to vote in that person. We are ready to ensure that that person become our leader is now. There is no two way about it, okay? There is no two way about it. We'll get there and we'll get there really soon. If election holds, is from one of those people you and I can see currently today that will become the president. Well, what's this, well, well, what position are you taking to ensure that we vote in that very right candidate? What position? What are you sincerely doing? So these are part of the things that are happening. It's a part of the things that are going on and it is high time we begin to make a change so we can be a happier people. Anyway, my wonderful people, now so the matter they reach us, so election don't land, Gidigba. Yes, let's make the difference. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Have a lovely and a fantastic day from us. It's bye for now. Remember, you have a voice. Bye.